Hey girls and guys, it's Presley, and I'd like to get some little issue that I'm wanting to get out of my chest for quite a while. It's all of my LGBTQ community members, allies, that have been, you know, struggling with a lot of homophobic people harassing them, telling them that, that it's just a phase, you guys are weak, you guys should burn in hell. You're possessed by a demon. I want you guys to know that you guys are not alone. You guys are not possessed by demons. You want to know why? You're just regular people. Regular people that just have different preferences on who you like like who you're sexually attracted to, and that's perfectly fine. You're not harming anyone. You're just a regular human being who's just a bit different and very special. I'm special, and I know it already because I came out to my grandma. She's a Christian. She accepted me as who I am. I came out to my mom. She accepted me as who I am. And I finally, finally, finally came out to my dad after a whole year of keeping in the secret for so long. And he finally accepted me as who I am. Thank God. I mean, hey, I thought he was going to be a homophobic Christian or something. Hey, I mean, I, I, did, I didn't expect him to be like, okay. And then he just turned the TV up because I just told him, I told him, hey, I got something important to tell you. Turn the TV down. He turned the TV down. I told him I was a lesbian. He, it was an awkward silence. My mom said, she likes girls. And, and then he said, okay. And that's it. That was it. Nothing more than just okay. You know, that went really well. I never expected to be that well. I mean, I thought it was going to end up much worse because my brain is, my brain thinks of weird scenarios on what would happen if, if my dad was homophobic or something, but I guess I thought wrong. He's just a chill dude who just loves me for who I am because I am his daughter. And after all, I am his daughter. And for you Christians out there, I'm not saying all of you Christians, because some Christians out there are pretty, you know, LGBT supportive. But there's a lot of Christians out there who are very judgmental, who like to just say that they're weak or they're, it's just a phase or whatever. They like to say stuff like that for some reason. I don't know why, but for some reason, they just like to say that. And I want to say to you, Judge Mill Christians, why do you care so much on who we sexually are, who are we sexually attracted to? Why do you care so much? Mind your own business. We LGBTQ community members, we are just regular people minding our own business. Why do you care so much? Mind your own business. That's all I'm saying. Mind your own business. Don't be so judgmental. Isn't there a saying like in the Bible that said, Thou shall not be judged? Correct me if I'm wrong, but I'm pretty sure something like that is said in the bible and christian and some of those judgmental christians knew that but again they ended up judging a lot of people who are gay and stuff i'm like really you guys are being a hypocrites say um saying that oh thou should not be judged you got uh god created everybody and the and then the next day they say God's didn't cre God didn't create gays or lesbians and be like, I'm like, what? You just said that God created everybody. Then why would you? You 
you guys are confusing me, man. Now, to be honest, I've never been bullied by anyone who was a very homophobic Christian or very judgmental because a lot of people I came, a very, a very few people I came out to, they didn't care. They were very supportive. They don't care. I'm glad they don't care because they're minding their own business. I'm minding my own business. It's because we are just regular people with different sexual preferences. And I like to say this, you guys are not alone. You guys aren't possessed by demons. You guys are loved by God. God loves you, Jesus loves you especially. I'm not a full-fledged Christian, but as long as I believe in God and Jesus, that's enough for me. That's enough for me. I don't read the Bible that much because I don't I norm I normally like don't take the time to just read the whole Bible and there's like so many quotes in the Bible that are just so small that I can barely read it. It's crazy, but hey. I still believe in God and Jesus. That's all that matters. Anyway, let me know in the comments if you're an LGBTQ like if you are a lesbian gay let me know and if you're a supporter of the community let me know too because I'd like to know I'd be really interested I mean hey I don't get a whole lot of comments on my channel but I just like to just see some comments every now and then I don't care but hey you can do whatever you want on this channel you don't I mean, just don't do any in, in, anything inappropriate on my channel. Just don't type in any inappropriate stuff on my channel because I will block you. Anyway, that's all I have for today's video. Like, comment, share, subscribe, all that jazz. And you homophobic people, stay away. Leave us be. And I'll see you guys in the next video. Peace.